Good evening, this is Lesson for Life, and we're reading today in Proverbs 3, and I know we, we wrote some stuff for, for Lessons for Life, uh, but there's just really so much stuff, there's so much that we can get from Proverbs 3 throughout the book, so I'm going to be writing stuff, uh, probably more than one thing for each proverb we read, and uh, sometimes doing adding a video, email, video uh, lesson along with it, and I just wanted to add one for Proverbs 3 uh, tonight, and one of the main, uh, they're all really excellent, but I guess uh, parts of this proverb that uh, you guys have memorized from before, and what, what part is that? Trust the Lord with all thine heart, and lean not unto thine own understanding, and all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct your path. Yeah, and you guys have memorized that from a long time ago, and that's probably... Um, you know, I I kind of keep saying this this is my favorite uh, scripture. This is where so many different things are encouraging, and we can get such a tremendous lesson from. But that really is one of <clears throat> the scriptures I remember uh, throughout. You know, it's really good for any situation. To uh, first of all, trust in the Lord. Trust in the Lord. Trust in the Lord. You're not trusting in man. Trust in the Lord, and then do what. Be not unto thine own understanding. Don't count on your own understanding. You know what? Our understanding is very limited. We don't understand everything that it, there is to understand. And it's, you know we can't depend upon that because our understanding is limited. So all we have to do is trust in the Lord. And don't <clears throat> lean on your own, you know, what, what, what you can comprehend, what you understand. Because it's, that's limited. And you're not always uh, thinking in the right frame of mind. And what else? And he shall direct your path. No, first we got to say, in all thy ways, acknowledge him. Yeah, in all your ways, acknowledge him. And that to me, uh, that right there is powerful too. In all your ways, acknowledge him. So just, and I like to think of it this, you know, <clears throat> there's so many different directions that we can take in life, so many different paths. But if we just remember to acknowledge Him in all of our ways, whichever direction, whichever way we're going, to the left, to the right, to the front, backwards, whatever, in all of your ways, acknowledge Him. Recognize that He's right there, that He is um, the supreme authority in your life in all your ways, whichever way you may be going. You might be going down a dark alley. You might be going on a bright lit street. In all your ways, whichever way that might be, do what? Acknowledge Him. Acknowledge Him. Remember him recognize that he's there and what's he going to do for you and he shall direct your path he's going to direct you he's going to give you direction he's going to tell you which way to go he's going to be right there um to to direct your path so you just have to you know whichever direction whichever way you're looking whichever way you're going in all your ways just acknowledge him recognize that he's there recognize his presence in whatever situation that you're in and you can count on him to direct your path so this is a, you know, just those two verses in this proverb is very powerful. There's just so much, so much more even I can speak about from this proverb. But that one I, I, I did want to do a video on. Trust in the Lord with all thy heart and lean not unto thine own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge him and he will direct your paths. Uh, with that, I say good night. Create yourself a wonderfully blessed day um, tomorrow and um, just... Remember to acknowledge him, whichever way you're going, acknowledge him and he's going to direct you.